Friday. How's Odell doing? He's uh, bouncing back. Is he full going now? Like, be out there tomorrow in a full practice just to get out there? Uh, he, was, uh, he was fine. He was out there today. Uh, involved in the rotation today. We'll take a look uh, tomorrow morning. Tomorrow. You, the defensive backs, would you prefer that specific players win specific roles on the top defense, or are you comfortable rotating because you have depth? Uh, we're gonna, you know, we love competition. Uh, that's that's the best way to get better, uh, and uh, we feel that we create some good competition. Coach Leon Hall uh, practiced for the first time as a Giant today. How do you think he adjusted in his first go around? Uh, right now, he's uh, getting his feet wet in the system. He's learning. He played a lot of football, uh, so uh, we expect him to make a quick transition. What do you have planned for him? What, what do you know? Schematically, or where, where do you plan to use him? How do you plan to use him? That kind of uh, thing. We're going to let him get his feet wet, get entrenched in the system, and uh, give him some opportunities inside. How's the running game doing uh, with the uh, running backs with Vereen, Darkwa, Jennings? How are they doing right now in camp? How are they progressing? Uh, the running backs seem to be uh, picking things up quickly. I think they had a nice day yesterday. Today was more mental. Can you envision using Leon in a safety type role at all? Never seen that. Is that I'm not going to give you the book. <laughs> Is that something you contemplated before bringing him in? Yeah, never say never. <laughs> Would you prefer that Rogers Cromartie eventually is either playing on the outside or playing on the inside, or you want to have the versatility to use him at both, as you've been showing? Yeah, we want versatility to use yeah. him yeah, inside and outside. you had a couple of days with Pretty good. We did some banging out there yesterday. He uh, had a chance the last couple of days to do some one on ones. Look very uh, disruptive, have a lot of, lot of energy. Uh, if you have a good question for him. Do you find that in general, those slot corners are the ones that can make that made some plays down the field. Likes to see him catch the ball a little bit cleaner. Uh, had a couple of bobbles, but he did come down with the ball. And his run game was uh, a priority. In that physical practice yesterday, was something that Bruce came out there after he did a couple of times. Is that an important test for him? Or would you rather not have something like that? Yeah, I think that's great. That's healthy. That's a part of it. He came okay. We didn't see him, we didn't see him do much today, today, though. Is there something that, is that oh, just playing? To, again, it's a part of the, the part of his program. That was the part uh, short to that. Who decides what goes on that mixtape? That's my design. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, today was a teaching day. So we dialed it back a little bit. Has anybody, has any player surprised you early or made a decision at a specific position more difficult than you? Let's get to the games. It's a little early. Let's let them fight through some things first. Right. What's you can have this with two or four weeks ago. How how happy are you with I guess the lack of results that you want to leave two sections of just in a quick way? Yeah, we're we're early. We're early. Don't jinx me. <laughs> was this the plan today to go to go light with a light practice or did you have yeah, to alter it as you went? We game? talked to him last night, this is the plan all along. We had a little more we had a called it a REM uh, REM Friday. So we had a little more rims last night, uh, brought them in a little bit later, uh, had a chance to hydrate them and uh, bring it back down. And, you know, we, we recovered this morning and we're starting that launch back up. And tomorrow's going to be a, a great day. What's rim? Like rim, rim sleep? Rim sleep. Rim sleep. Mm -hmm. What do you see tomorrow, mm -hmm. longest practice in the camp? Yeah, we're going to build up. It's going to be long, it's going to be physical, it's going to be fast. So full, full pads or just up? Oh, yeah, full pads. Yeah. What do you see from Eric Flowers? Uh, Eric Flowers is, uh, is a young man who's learning to trust his technique. Uh, he's fighting hard out there. Uh, OB is not someone who's going to make it real easy on him. Uh, so he's, uh, he's learning the battle to, you know, with a good competitor out there. Have the guys on Puff had any setbacks? I know we said JT was getting close a couple of days ago, but he's still there. Uh, no setbacks. 
One more. What do you like about your offensive line? Uh, Mike Solari uh, has been around the game for a long time, and uh, you know he's a he's a tremendous football coach. And 